What's up, YouTube? Welcome to the King's Court. A lot of people have been suggesting that I get into Meta Runner, so today we are going to check out episode one just for you. Let's get it. Video games are everything. Okay. Jobs, entertainment, lifestyle. It's the engine that powers society itself. And to make it in this society, you need to win a lot. So is this the origin of Tari, or does she come before this? You name it. There are gamers who train every waking moment of their life in hopes of becoming the best. And at the top of the food chain, you have meta runners. People who are willing to replace their limbs just for a boost in accuracy, okay. dexterity, and performance. With legions of fans who adore them, meta runners are the best of the best. That is, until the world sees what I have planned. Until the world sees you. What do you have planned? Tari. <gasps> oh no. Huh? What? You did it! You so you replace her arm? I'm so proud of you, Tari. <laughs> We're going to ramp up the difficulty a bit. Just turn the volume up a little bit. I want you to try your best. <laughs> oh god, no! No, 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 no! Shut up! Shut up! Doctor! What the hell did I do? Hang in there! Get tired to me! <laughs> what is going on? Where is she at? What did they do to Artari? I've always wanted to live in a cyberpunk-esque futuristic city like this. Something about this just draws me in. Oh, hey, did you want to send? No, sorry, just looking. I can't believe you missed the bus, bro. I mean, to be fair, that bus was never stopping, so. Hey, it's Axel back there. Huh? Oh. <laughs> oh, excuse me, ma'am. I bet you've heard of gaming chairs that go 180 degrees. But can you do this? Oh my gosh. Are you okay? I don't know if I'd want my gaming chair to do that. She just crawled out of a back alley, like after this crazy doctor had performed Wait surgery on her. You would think that, that she hey, would uh, not be looking into a video arm. cafe. You're a meta runner, right? Excuse me, can I have your autograph? Um, oh! I can't believe I'm meeting a real life meta runner! Ah! What? Oh, no, 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 I, I'm not. Which gaming company are you with? COG? Cloud7? Uh, Al Alpha Max? Um, yes! Uh, what? Can you believe this? I'm with... Tazcorp? Uh, that's right, and, uh, speaking of which, I, I think they're calling me there now. So, gotta go, you know? <laughs> Hmm. 
Interesting, interesting. She clearly not with Tascorp. Oh! Uh, um... That's ah! not well, how you sell stuff to customers. You don't just pop up and, and scare them. Uh, no, thank you. That looks painful. Ah, uh, not your style, eh? Well, what about an Alpha X stabilizing wristband? Infinite accuracy glove? Glitchy box console? Comes with a free game? Tesco pen and headset? I mean, it Alpha comes with a free game. You might as well buy it. Ooh. Ooh, the duck. Wait, wait, no. I was wondering if you could tell me where I am. My memory's a bit hazy. Ah, I see. Party too hard last night, huh? No problem. Afrobot is here to help. You're in Silica City, the video game capital. Okay. Silica City. Okay, Silica that City. We're cool. learning a lot about this and lore there's no so place far. To be in Silica City than a Tescorp superstore with top of line peripherals, tools, and gaming enhancements, as well as the world's greatest esports team. Tescorp is the most trusted name in gaming. Tescorp, the new meta. The new um, meta, okay. Now let's find the perfect meta. gaming enhancement for you. Maybe a geosynchronized orthopedic mouse. Um, I wonder if she was naturally left-handed, and that's why they chose to go with the left hand. And why wouldn't you do both arms? Look at that determination, ladies and gentlemen. This isn't your average meta runner here. Oh my god, that frame perfect precision. All she has to do now is execute the coconut burst jump, and the world record is hers. <laughs> For those new here, the She's gonna hit the coconut burst jump. First jump. jump. She's gonna hit the coconut burst, burst jump. Level in half, and we're about to witness it in all its glory. <gasps> Remember now, the coconut burst jump comes in two parts. Here we go. The beginning of the glitch. It's all or nothing now. There's the setup. And now she's positioning herself. Oh, and there it is! A perfect wall clip! What is she? She's now glitched herself inside the wall, allowing for the final and hardest part of the glitch. Here it is! The coconut burst jump! Will it be enough to break her out of the wall? I don't know. I don't know. It's getting intense, though. Holy smokes, it worked! It actually worked! This is it! She just has to land, and we have a new speedrunning champion! Oh no. oh no! No! She missed! She just missed the run! It's dead, folks! No! It was right there! Just one stupid jump! Oh! Yeah, I understand the competitiveness no to be idea mad. What was going on, but that looked awesome! Yeah! Ultra Jump Mania! Oh! Such a weird controller. I know it's supposed to be futuristic, but you would think that would just add a level of difficulty wow. to the game. Good job, Tari. Aw. Damn it. Hmm? Uh, what do you think you're doing? This is the speedrunners arena. I don't know if you understand, but you need this thing called skill to be. Oh, oh, I made it over the spikes! Yes! Oh! <laughs> I wonder, you know, uh, when you first start playing something or doing something, there's just this magical sense of accomplishment that you get from beating something or overcoming something that you had never overcome before. Um, I wonder when you progress to the point where you're speed running these games 
and you've mastered techniques and strategies if that spark is still there or if it's gone i, I really don't know if anyone does speed running or anything like that let me know if that spark is still there when you overcome the challenges that you previously faced that you couldn't pass before don't suppose you could show me how to make coconut boy go as fast as you did <laughs> you want me to teach you advanced speed running tricks when it looks like you've never touched a game in your life Fine, I'll just figure it out myself. This world revolves around games, kid. If you ain't any good, don't bother. Go be a janitor or something. It's too late, she's already got the bionic arm. <sighs> you know, button mashing ain't gonna get you anywhere. So you have played this before? Am I winning? <sighs> okay. It's like, it, maybe it's like she's there herself. An island? Is this a dream? What? What is all this? Interesting. So it's not just her arm that's bionic. Uh, ow! Uh, who the... Take that, foul beast! Wait. Coconut boy? Ow! Yo, girl, you all right? I don't think she is. <laughs> uh, Lux, you might want to see this. I'll call you back. It's one of my meta runners. What is it, Belle? I'm extremely busy explaining to the press about your disappointing failure of a performance tonight. Hey, that's fair. Screw that's you, fair. Man. You go and do better. Oh wait, you can't play video games for crap. There's no need for language like that, dear Belle. Need I remind you who owns you, and who can decommission you in an instant? Really? Intimidation? Come on, Lux. That might work on your other meta runners, but we both know you wouldn't let anything Her happen eyes are to really large. Uno here. Maybe I will, after today's performance. What triggered this? I don't know. She just sort of freaked out and froze. I thought I broke her, you know, emotionally. Wait, Coconut Boy? Lux, is she in the- Bring in the Tazcore scientists. I want all of them here, now. Yeah, it seems like you might need to study this. That was episode one of season one of Meta Runner, Wrong Warp. I actually think I like this better than Sunset Paradise. Maybe it's just because of the way that it is aesthetically pleasing to me with the whole cyberpunk futuristic, you know, feeling. Um, I just I just tend to be drawn to that, like altered carbon or something like that. Um I thought it was great. I didn't realize how fast it went by because I was drawn into the story. Um, however, I do think Murder Drones is probably my favorite. So if I had to go one, it'd be Murder Drones, then this, and then Sunset Paradise. It just is what it is. Um, but we will definitely keep watching this if you guys let me know that this is what you want me to watch. Hit the like button. Hit the subscribe button. Come join us in Discord. Come be a member of the Royal Family. I'll see y'all later. Peace.